Hello everybody, welcome to my channel. Uh, it's Eva from Bohemian Crafting here. I would like to welcome you in my new craft room, in my new studio. I have spent last few weeks with cleaning my studio. Uh, while creating my journals, I made a huge mess all around. And as this is also my bedroom, it was very important to tidy up my mess. Uh, I start to feel like I'm losing my mojo, but it wasn't losing my mojo. I was disgusted by my room. I will put here a few pictures so you can imagine what I have created, how messy I started to be and why I went through to all that change. I felt terrible, <clears throat> like really terrible. What have I did with my room and with no, with my room, it was really disgusting, disgusting. Uh, I kind of took few uh, not good habits, which are not healthy and they are not uh, raising my creativity. I started many, many different projects, which I didn't finish. Uh, after these projects, after I created just a small part of that project, uh, I didn't even tidy up after myself and that was uh, another my terrible habit. And uh, that's why I, my, my room ended up like a huge mess, like disgusting, disgusting mess. So I had to change it. Uh, I spent a few weeks with that work. A uh, few times I felt like I'm gonna cry. I regret it few times that uh, why why I not just <laughs> that starting that starting was good that I already started I regretted what I did before so I'm gonna show you very quickly what I've got here as my room I'm not gonna go through all these boxes because it's actually just paper craft it's papers over there there is my bed behind my table so there are boxes with papers, here are boxes with craft supplies like uh, metal embellishments, uh, stickers, um, oh, I don't know what is there, frames, uh, molds, uh, yeah, labels, etiquettes, butterflies, uh, all kind of yeah, glitters here. All kind of that embellishment here, uh, mostly in these drawers, uh, in these drawers I've got um, metal things like closures and stuff like that. Underneath I've got three drawers with unfinished projects. Behind me, in those boxes uh, and the drawers are papers, fabrics, stamps and dies. Here behind me in that beautiful <coughs> bookcase, I've got papers six by six on the top, then my own papers designs. And then on the bottom, I've got 12 by 12. And here in that uh, pigeon hall, I've got cards and small, um, uh, yeah, also colors and Sharpies and uh, stuff like that. That I've got more for decorating my room. You've got these pictures and there is end of my room and my board <laughs> i have created for this room <laughs> here behind me i've got still two boxes which i can't even fit in here my room is overloaded overloaded with stuff and i have to start to do something with this uh, always when i watch some video and i see something new i was like oh i have to have it oh i have to have it hmm? It was really bad. If you do have same habits like I did, and if your room start to be overloaded, maybe it's time that you will jump in it and do same what I did. Go through every single paper, every single piece, every single die, and start to sort it out, and then start to use it. I forgot to use my craft supplies. I always bought bought new supplies and now I don't know where to place it. Those two boxes and um, uh, this is just um, cereal boxes for my for my journals but those two boxes which I don't know where to place them that's a huge red flag for me that stop buying and start to use everything I've got. So this is my new craft room. 
if you feel the same like I felt, uh, if you think that you are losing your mojo or you don't want to craft uh, for some reason and you don't, you are not sure which is that reason. Maybe maybe you need to reorganize, maybe you need changed colors. It's actually helped to me to change my room to gray and pink. Uh, I think these colors will kind of motivate me to keep this, this room clean because uh, these colors are more, I'm not sure how to call that, uh, not like posh, not, not like posh, but more for clean spaces, I think. So hopefully these colors will motivate me to clean after every single creating season or a session. Session is the right word. So hopefully that will motivate me. Tidy up, Evie. Otherwise you will end up in huge mess again. I'm happy I did it. Even it was very hard work. It was very painful to see what I did. And I felt... How is that the right word? Uh, when you feel... Uh, I felt awkward for myself <laughs> what I have became so if you do have same problem stay strong and jump in it I know it it's hard work I know it's scary to go all that stuff through to all that stuff and maybe you will regret it a few times that that can happen but in the end I'm so happy I did it I'm, I am I can't explain, express how much happy I am I did it because now I feel like a human in my room. Like I am creative, but I'm human. I'm not messy. I'm not, not if I will say pig, I will hurt to that animal. <laughs> that I feel normal in this room. I know I've got still huge stuff, but uh, it's clean. It smells fresh. It's it's nice to have a look so go for it i know it's scary and i know uh, it needs few maybe few days maybe few weeks to to what is that right word uh, to prepare yourself for that hard work but go for it you will don't regret it in the end you will be happy and uh, if you do have a problem like I had that you think that you are maybe losing your mojo in the end you will feel amazing you will feel I want to actually create something finally again so thank you so much for jumping in and I hope we will create together something nice <laughs>